Welcome to Rolls of Redemption. <laughs> Welcome. Hi. Oh, hello. Hi. Oh, I had volume up on my headphones and you screamed hi and almost lost an eardrum. <laughs> Well, oh, sorry, that was, that all right. was my fault. Welcome to Rolls of Redemption, where we redeem your Monday. One roll at a time. Today, we are working with high-speed internet. We are jazz. We're about to go right into initiative. So, yeah, let's get started. <laughs> we have implemented a whole new system that is going to involve a written recap, ready to go by our very own Bard. All right, so last week we chased down a boat owned by the Scarlet Brotherhood, eventually caught up to him, um, and after a couple of fireballs and some more, let's say, conventional fighting, we managed to board their boat, find the deeds that we'd um, inexplicably, no, that's not the right word, um, unwisely given to Anders, um, and, and reclaim those. Unfortunately, the last combatant on the boat managed to kill themselves before we could interrogate them and wring any more information out of them. Uh, after that chaos, our party found itself making a quick time to the Shahaugan stronghold, uh, where Atreus, magically gifted with the ability to speak to the Shahaugan and disguised by my personal magic to look like the Shahaugan, we combined to connive our way to the depths of the fortress with no one the wiser to our plot to rescue the lizard folk little ones. But our luck might be running out. Some Shahaugan have become suspicious, and while Akir has located the children, time will tell if we are able to escape or whether we'll end up swimming with the fishes. I, I really liked there your you very bardic way of telling the story with the emphasis on how good you did to make this plan work. Thank Bardic you. is better Thank than you. my Olaf version. Right? So, Bard, yeah. high charisma, high ego. It, you, you gotta have both. It just doesn't work. Listen, Mina has done not much, but Janine has provided decent <laughs> ideas. <so. laughs> it's been unfortunately an exceptionally well executed uh, dungeon crawl. You almost said well, because... well thought out. But you know we didn't think about I know it, better. so we just like came up with things on the spot, and it worked. Hey, hey, I, I resent that. There was I a Scooby Doo plan it's good. With that was reviewed, denied. Um, then there was a familiar who went ahead and explored the entire top two floors of the dungeon, um, and then died. Um, and they were able to really just kind of walk past all of my pre-planned encounters and by having the familiar like check out the second floor avoided all of the encounters on the second floor and i was you know following the module really doing my best where every like five minutes or every intersection you roll a d12 to see if there's a random patrol i think i tossed 15 or 20 d12s no 12s came up so we did, we yeah. did good we did good we we and decided not to murder hobo because we figured that if we murder hobo we would be the hobos being murdered so <laughs> yep exactly yep. precisely and like i just figured if we started attacking like a group then more groups would show up and then we would just be stuck in the middle of this place being surrounded by groups of things wanting to kill us <laughs> Yep. Just didn't want that for myself, you know? I thought it would be a lot of fun, but I got outvoted. So, oh well. Cool. Uh, so, most recently, they were brought by the Wave Chaser, or the Wave Shaper, so that is the Shahaugan equivalent of a druid. And she's looking for the general of the army, um, finding very violently that he's not in the arena. Uh, she has brought them all into the jails. Um, unbeknownst to the Shahaugan here, our friendly neighborhood ranger rolled a 38 for his stealth check and got in there, scoped it out, and has already had some secret secrets with some of the prisoners. Um, but the general himself is here. He is a four-armed, massive, hulking monster of a 
Jay Halgen. That's wears... the one you went with. That's the one you went with. <laughs> of all of all the equipment and gear that we have as cosplayers and Ren Fair people, that's what you went with. The that's child's right. plastic helmet. Look, okay. I Just had checking. to make sure that Amazon sent it and it arrived today for this stream. Wow. I, I like how the point. eye holes are perfectly situated for your eyes. Yeah, it's squeezing my temples heavily, so this is not going to last. Oh, thank God. But, so what you're saying is the longer I can we make like this, this conflict last, the less involved you'll be able to be. Totally, yes. We're just going to take so out the DM. Let's get this over with. Yeah. Um, Nathan and I got booted off for a second, but... Um, we should just take a moment to plug our Kofi, um, where all of this happened about what we had just talked about. Um, so if you want to see all of our Scooby-Doo plans that Rob sometimes says we can do and sometimes says we can't, um, definitely join the Kofi. I think it's like $3 a month and it's definitely worth it. Uh, you can also have an opportunity to solve puzzles and get to choose which monsters we fight. So, oh, yeah. did for any of the three NPCs... a month, you can force those too. Yeah, did any of the NPCs uh, <laughs> solve that puzzle? No, not yet. The puzzle is still not at yet. large <laughs> in the NPC tavern. So, <laughs> so know. how long are we giving them? Is there a time limit on this? Nope. Whenever uh, somebody has time to sit down and Solve the puzzle so, whenever so it, no certain people have it. their children um, and then are able to think clearly because the pregnancy brain fog is gone. That's also a viable option. So, If I spoil it I've for never, them. I never think clearly, even with pregnancy brain. Like, without pregnancy brain, I don't know what I'm saying. I'm going to just sit here and drink. Bye. <laughs> but I, but if, I, if I spoil it for them, does it make it moot? No, it's just the first one who types it gets the victory. So definitely don't spoil it mm. for them because then that guarantees someone will get it. That guarantees, yeah. Yeah, and Dex is always watching. Yeah, he is. He okay. really is. I'm going to keep right. my visor up here. So setting the scene, um, the five of you, because both familiars have either been killed or dismissed due to the fact that they were going to drown, are in a fairly large jail area. Uh, you have two of these deep diver Shehaugen uh, behind you. They look, uh, they're a little more, more pale than the average Shehaugen because they have some reminiscence of those deep, uh, deep water angler fish, uh, extra large eyes and uh, just really kind of gnarly uh, looking fellows. Uh, they both have tridents. So they look like me, pale, big eyes, gnarly mouth. <laughs> Do you own a mirror in your home? I was gonna say, do you have no. you like looked at yourself lately? I just yes, and I have pink eyes. Right. So I, I, I mean, rant. the main thing I keyed in on was the pale part, <laughs> considering how red you are. Just, I just don't. I'm not seeing it. Anyway, I I shouldn't have derailed. I should have Flag on the play. You, you brought Carry you brought on. it on to yourself. Um, yep. So there's that. Um, the wave cha wave shaper. Like I said, she's a little more druidic-y. Um, she has sharper scales as if uh, she is more of a shark kin um, a deeper connection to the powers of the ocean and all of that um, she carries a staff as uh, she has already threatened to use on some of our people um, the jail itself is where did my image go but for all of you so I can describe it most properly about 70 feet long about 40 feet deep. It consists of five jail cells, each with iron um, bars to double, like a five foot iron door bars. So you can see in, they can see out, but there is no passage between. Um, the ones on either end happen to have air bubbles, and the party has figured out that Isala and uh, Thunin, the lizard folk hatchlings, and the prince and princess, if you will, of the lizard folk are in these two as they keep going up to the surface to breathe and then coming back to see what's going on. Uh, there's a triton locked away. There is the corpse of a giant, massive dead eel um, who has dislodged something in the wall. And then there is a sea lion. Um, not a sea lion, 
like the cute little blubbery animal that you want to pet and cuddle, um, a sea lion, which is something more closely related to a um, aquatic version of a griffin or chimera type creature. Um, really angry, really large, really upset uh, to be locked away. Cool. Um, as I said, there was General Makat. Uh, he and his four arms and his fancy helmet are surveying a large Shahogan champion and the two war priests as they have taken a Lokath, which is a very um, fish person. It's not a person with fish elements. It's a fish See, I person. struggled with that because every time I saw that word, my brain auto-corrected to Loth Cat. If anyone watched Star Wars Rebels, and I was like, "There's a Loth Cat there. There's a Loth Cat. It's a Loth Cat." Why is there a Loth Cat underwater? I don't know. <laughs> I just couldn't correct I don't know. it. If if you've ever heard the question, um, what happened to the mermaid? If would you choose tail with person body or fish top with person bottom that's what the locath is it is the fish top no thank you person bottom shark and maui arms. but is it wearing pants shark maui i have one of those in my room <laughs> uh, it's it's in the office where peter is but i have a shark uh, maui <laughs> that's amazing that's fantastic um shark so what you do need to know about this poor locath is that um, it has been chained up to a torture device. Um, it's Whoa. hands, uh, big, like, its gills are literally flayed open. No. Um, its legs are tied down, and as you look at it, you can see various cuts, various stab wounds. Um, it looks like somebody even tried to carve their initials into his fish scales, as they have been peppering this thing with all sorts of um, questions, comments, uh, probably not too many concerns, but lots of disparaging remarks. And it is into um, this that the Wave Shaper brings the four of you, having realized that Akir somehow managed to slip away. And she is very upset. Could you repeat the one bit about the something has to go up to the air bubbles and then come That's back the down? The lizard folk kids? The two lizard folk, yes. They can hold their breath for extended periods of time, but they cannot breathe. Water. Do we know how long they can hold their breaths for? I will take a nature check. But also, Atreus and I have um, water breathing potions in case it becomes an issue. Good, good. Then good. we can. Uh, does a 13 get me there? Probably more than 10 minutes. The, uh, my seven is not not doing anything. So, all right. Yeah. So we'll assume like ten ish minutes, which is good to know. Combat doesn't take that long, right? Never. Com Combat, no. But what about the escape? The escape. Yeah. Can I make an um? Is it an insight check or a perception check on the Lothcat to get its alignment? See, it's not going to uh, happen. It's going to be lost cat forever. You may certainly. <laughs> which one should? Which one would you like me to make? Um, I will go with insight. That is going to be a fourteen. Um, he's obviously opposed to the Shahogan, so he's more likely than not neutral or good um, um, and as part of the war council uh, Drasira would know that the Lokath are one of the allies of the lizard folk that's what I was going to ask not that Didn't lizard folk are necessarily good we share a common enemy uh, today you, yeah. you, yes um, at least right now it yeah, is like we would know it but I mean, Trisea in... slash Kai was not as a part of any of that and I can't remember if any Lokaths were at the council meeting or not. I'd say if anything's behind bars here, they're probably going to be on our side for at least 20 minutes. Well, except the sea <laughs> lion. Really... Except the sea lion because it's an animal. But Akir still wants to use him. Well, wait, I'm really
really good at animal, animal handling. Animal friendship. I totally use that thing. I'm good and with all the animals. Doesn't Torkoal have animal friendship? Except for Akira. We haven't figured out how my bagpipes are working underwater yet. <laughs> so, <laughs> yes, I have it. animal friendship, kind of. Well, a Akira is going well, to Well, I tell... guess we haven't decided whether I have to play them or whether I can just kind of just, I don't know, stroke them appreciatively. And those are your choice words. You know, <laughs> I realized it was going bad, but it was no. too late. No, next. <laughs> well, Akira is going to <laughs> speak right into along. Atreus's mind and say, if anyone can tame that sea lion, I absolutely want to make use of it. Great. Great. Fantastic. We will save that for last. <laughs> we should probably get our people into um, the safety of the eel cell first, but, you know, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nobody revivify that eel because that would no. We don't want that. Suck. Use him to <laughs> push die. into other people. <laughs> yes. <Ooh. laughs> Unless Torkoal animates it. Okay. I I have no more animate objects. My that spell slot was used for seeming. There's no more until hopefully tomorrow. If there's a tomorrow. If there's a tomorrow. Yeah. All right. Um yeah. So with arms folded on top and second set of arms folded across his belly, uh General Makat kind of turns to all of you and speaks in Shahaugan, so only Atreus understands you. What are you doing here? I'm kinda of gonna just look at my people. Are we all ready to go? Great. Uh, and I'm going to look back at the uh, terrifying guy. I'm going to say, starting a revolution. And we're going to break <laughs> and we're going to roll initiative now. And we're all, all going right. to attack him. Yay! <laughs> so I need everyone to roll Let's initiative. Go. I thought we might try and beat around the bush a little bit more, but here we are. <laughs> <laughs> no! I'm done! I've spent this entire time lying my way through the Atreus is so over this. <laughs> He's just like I, I like sledding underwater. <laughs> just just as a note, Rob, like, for, na I'm... for now, I I do have my shield out. Okay. That's a dirty 20 on the so initiative. So you have advantage, and you're going to have to pop off the shield to use your thieves tools. Oh, I'm going to have to pop off Guys, my shield for the thieves um... tools. Okay. Oh, yes. I did not roll that at advantage. Do that again. And it's the same. Uh, I, I rolled a 22. 16. Rob, wow. is, is initiative, do we get to roll the extra D3s for initiative? Yes, oh. yes you do. So I think that was Torkoal and Atreus have extra D3s mm -hmm. for initiative. I'm so mad right now because these are some of the best initiative rolls I have ever gotten. And I am thrilled except all of my high initiative rolls are for your allied NPCs. Okay, let's nice. make that a 23 for my initiative then. Ooh, Torkoal's going first. How, what do we, we type here to, write, to roll the D3 again? I'm sorry. I'm having a moment, y'all. Uh, you can type exclamation the, mark R. Exclamation mark yeah. okay. R D3. Yep. And when you're, when you're just rolling right. something, you can have your regular roll and then you can do a space dash B and then like D three to add. Okay, we've bonus. gotten too far, and I don't. I will never remember too anything to type ever. Too many words. I roll with the Nathan. app, Nathan, and <laughs> that didn't work. There had to be a space there because. Listen, I'm a dumb. I'm a dumb. Listen, Nathan, don't say words that are Wait. triggering their chat right now. <laughs> What's wrong with you? I don't know what words are, trigger. Is it a space <laughs> then D three? Nathan, what are you doing? Having a moment, y'all. Then yes, we're allowing it just because we have to. Another I, 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 now, my, now my initiative is 19. There God, we go. Dude, this is not fair. I'm a dumbass Shark and not bait, good at ooh, technology. Ha, ha. So first up is Akir's surprise round. Nice. Yep. You love to see it. Because... So you have a full round of your action, bonus action, movement, blah, 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 to do whatever it is you were preparing to do. 
because nobody knows where you are except kind, kind of, of Atreus. Atreus. Because I told him what I was doing. He knows you're in here. I know. I know where you are. I'm smart. I'm observant. Also, our Torkoal and I... Are Torkoal and I sort of still stealthified because we never left the 30... You are not stealth or hidden, but you okay. do have the plus 10 to your stealth because you have always been within his aura. So Got should it. you decide to hide for any particular reason, yes. All right, so Thieves Tools is going to be an action, right? Yes. Then we're just going to do that. We're going to Thieves Tools the Triton cell first. So I'll pop off the shield, and is that sleight of hand? Yep. It is sleight of... I mean, technically it's these tones, but I don't think you made a thing know. for that yet. So <laughs> We'll have to make that. It should be the same bonus either way, but... Because I'm not proficient in the tools. So, yeah, so it's what just the roll? dex check. That's going to be a 23. Yeah. Because I got magic um, gloves. You, yeah, you suddenly just kind of, and uh, the lock pops open and the um, door swings and you hear from inside in um, Aquin. Do you have a trident or sword or something I can slit throats with? Um, oh, I do still have an extra rapier. Yes, I would like to, if I can, pull a rapier and hand it to him. So there's your item interaction. And then I think I'm... And you dropped your shield yep. as your bonus? I think I might be out of stuff, so I'm going to move into the back corner to be close to Thinan's cell, and then I will end my turn there. Nice. All right. Then first up in the initiative proper is Torkoal. All right. I'm going to move up to that corner previously discussed, and I am going to cast Fear... Um, so I should be hitting Makat, and I, I forget how many people are in that corner, but I should be able to hit everyone except the Lokaf with... You are her. going to provoke an opportunity attack from the Wave Shaper if you pass her and keep on going. So be it. All right. He's going to try, and do you have all of your hit points? I've got 100 of 101. You do not have all of your hit points. Fantastic. She has advantage. Oh, wow. Okay. Yes. I don't like She's that. She's going to try and claw you. Okay. Fine. Fine. So with, with her empty hand, she just kind of reaches out. And just like the grapple can't touch me get off of me 23 to hit uh, that's gonna hit <laughs> can't touch us ow you are going uh, to take <laughs> oh you can touch me a little bit <laughs> I, I thought he'd already rolled it was like she tried I was like, oh. 17 points of slashing damage and as her claws pull your blood out from your body you feel the water itself just kind of freeze into your wounds and you take four points of cold damage. Fun. So, 21 total. Fun, fun, fun. Yep. Yep, I got that. Yep. That's fine. But yes, you can do you can do the thing now. All right. I'm going to do the thing. It is a 16 wisdom saving throw from all involved. I'm going to throw the map up on the stream real quick just so that everyone else can see what we're looking at. So that's a, that's a third level slot for those playing along at home. 
All right, so that is going to be the Warlock B. Getting a Wisdom save? Yep. See if I have anything against it. I do not. Wow, my dice are really slow today. B is going to. <laughs> that was a two minus one. Good. That was the that uh, this was one a nineteen that one. minus. Oh, that yeah, passed. that was a dirty one. That that's gonna pass. So the eighteen will pass. Uh, here comes our dear friend, the general. Come on, Makat, fear me. Yeah. Yes! Get out of here. He is afraid. I'm not even... In, that's annoying. The cat's okay. afraid. And they have nowhere to hide and get First out of my sight. First he was sight. afraid. So... Will he be petrified? He, no. Oh, he's you don't have those spells. He, he's he's going to be afraid for the full minute, though, because he's got nowhere to get outside for me and try and break it. Yeah. Uh, does a 15 save? 15 does not. 16. We're looking for a 16. Ooh, stunning. Oh, I'm really having fun. This is great. I am enjoying this. Me too. All right, that, that one's saved. Okay. The two of them saved. And so the Wave Shaper does not have proficiency. Are you kidding me? Sorry. Come on, dice. Don't do that. <laughs> It's a five. I All love right. it when it doesn't work for you. Oh, that's so good. So we basically that. have two of, well, two of them in that corner that oh, we there's have a champion. to deal with. We, get oh, this we got one more. I've got a good feeling about this. There's a whole lot of baddies. Don't wait. There's nope. 13. Too cocky, Peter. Nope. Reel it back. <laughs> nope. Okay. So there's only two in that corner Nicely that we have done. to deal with, and the rest of them are all cowering in a little puddle. So, or will be momentarily. Right. Let's re. Um, what does the fear spell do exactly? So, fear project a phantasmal image of a creature's worst fears. Each creature in thirty foot cone must succeed on a wisdom save, uh, or drop whatever it's holding and become frightened for the duration. What is well, frightened by the spell. Mm -hmm. um, a creature must take the dash action, move away from you by the safest available route on each of its turns, unless there is nowhere to move. If the creature ends its turn in a location where it doesn't have line of sight to you, the creature can make a wisdom saving throw. On a successful save, the spell ends for that creature. So they could go and try and hide with the poor little lizard folk if they want to get away from me. I would like to request yeah. that the terrifying image that they had that Torkoal has created that the T Shahogan are terrified of is an image of Mina <laughs> as a golden dragon yes. Mina as a golden dragon I'm yeah. here for it they've all heard stories here we go they have all heard <laughs> stories um, what really they actually see is they suddenly see through the seeming and their worst fear is coming to <laughs> Come to, uh, literally come to them. <laughs> it's just yeah. yeah. All right. So yeah. So they, they've got a minute unless they can life. figure out how to get out of my sight and and make a wisdom save. All right. So I have one priest and one diver. Um. And passed. hey, Mina, have some bardic while we're Hell yeah. while we're having fun. Which also, you guys, <laughs> you guys are blocking the counter. exit, and so they can't. They can't get out without nope. multiple opportunity attacks. Should we it's start true. doing drums too? We cannot get out. <laughs> Sorry. You can lock right. them in here. Drums will sound good. Yes. <laughs> all right. So that's all I got. For the. Yeah. Hot Mess Express for my guys. All right. Next up is going to be Akir. Cool, 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 cool. I'm going to unlock Thunin's cage. I feel like this might be a mistake and I should do this right. later, but we're just going to do it now to try and get everyone out. Uh, 17 on sleight of hand. 
That is enough. Great. Um, they, it's not as beautiful and easy. It does take you, you know, a couple of seconds, but the lock itself and uh, pops open, and you see Thunin just kind of take a big deep breath and swim down. Great. Um, Is the does the eel cell look locked or no? It does. Okay. Yes. Cool. It is locked. That's what I figured. Um, and which creatures did did not fail fear, or I guess which ones look like they're still getting ready to attack us? Uh, the only one you can see, one of the war priests, the one closest to um, Isala's okay. cell. Um, everyone else is like has literally dropped their weapons. Got it. Like the wave shaper's staff is on the ground. Makat's um, swords are on the floor. So. Nice. Well done, Torkel. Yeah, at Torkel's feet. Man, what do I even do then? You've got movement and you've got a bonus action. Yeah. I don't think I have a good bonus action that I want to do right now. Um, actually, yes, there is. How far apart? No, they're way too far apart. I'll just do this then. I'm going to cast Sanctuary on Torkoal. <laughs> um, so I, I would give you inspiration, but I'm mad at you. <laughs> <laughs> so is this basically Torkoal just stand there and be scary? Is that basically what this means? Um, and I mean, really, mm -hmm. I, really, I'm. If you wanted to do something in between, you can, but this allows you to essentially just be the support character that you are. Um, but more importantly, oh, ooh, in this in this first round, it means that no one is going to try and attack you, or at least it's going to be very hard for them to. Um, so for the next for, for the next minute, um, any creature who targets you with an attack or harmful spell must first make a wisdom saving throw, and if they fail. They must choose a new target or lose the attack or spell. Um, nice. You are still affected by area of effects, and you can't attack or cast a an effect on an enemy or deal damage to another creature. Otherwise, the spell ends. But at least okay. until your next so, turn, they're gonna have a hard time, harder time hitting you. So then I'm gonna go and okay. So I know I'm doing next turn. Um, and then I'm going to move forward to get closer to the eel cell, just because I think I'll need to in order to reach it next round. Um, so probably about where Mina and Atreus are, and then I end turn. I was going to say, you could hand off the Thieves' Tools to me if you want me to try and unlock the cell, because that's not a spell. That's not a, an attack. That's your sleight of hand? Um, my sleight of hand is plus five. That's not bad. I guess we could give it a try. And worst case, you could try and hand it off to me. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's do that. I can I reach Torkoal? Um, I might not be able to reach you actually. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, no. fifty feet. Can you no. just drop them in front of the cage? I could. You you could you could basically step up to the cage and hold them out for Torkoal to take. Yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll have them in my hand at the cage. That way it makes a little bit more mechanical sense. I feel like it wouldn't make a lot of sense for me to just like drop. <laughs> so I'll just hold them at the ready like I'm going to, but if oh. Torkoal moves faster, then so be it. Because then I can, on my I next turn, it. start attacking things. So... Very cool. All right. Uh, next up in the initiative is the sea lion. Um, it's going to try and break down the bars. It doesn't really seem to know what's going on. 
but um, it's angry and something has changed. So it's going to do a thing. Gilf. Yeah. I also am resistant to change. Lash out when things get weird. <laughs> oh, Rob, am I able to have picked up my shield? I don't know if I had to like drop it, drop it. You have to pop it off so you can use your item okay. interaction yeah. to I just pick want to make sure that yeah. I, I still have that with me because I don't think I'm going to be going back to that corner anytime soon. So. so he's doing a good job hitting. But. Wait, wait. No. He's doing a good job hitting who? The bars. The bars. Ah, oh, oh. Right, right, right. Got it. And it tries to bite, and its mouth is just too big, and it can't. Um, so you see this massive hulking creature smashing against these uh, iron bars, and even with all of its power and strength, the bars don't seem to take any of the damage it's dealing. Um, okay. Uh, next up is our beloved Thunin and his prank happy self. Um, he is going to swim down. These kids better not get hurt or I'm going to be upset. <laughs> Do you want to know how many hit points he's got? No, probably like three. I mean, I did <laughs> instruct him just to escape, I think. Yeah, but are they going to listen to you? You're a bird with no pants. And he's gonna give and a, he looked like a, a very the time. awkward hug. Oh goody. Oh, baby. From behind. Gross. <laughs> and he's gonna just kinda hide behind the Kier's table. Right. Good choice, oh, then and oh, well done. I'm proud oh, of you. I was tempted so, I was uh, tempted Akir, to cast Sanctuary on my I'm gonna need but... you to make an opposed rap. What? Check. <laughs> He's hugging. That's can, he like okay, got can he wear him like a backpack? Can he wear him like a backpack? You can fail. Oh, that was almost really bad. 16. So he hugs you and you kind of pat him and then break free of the grapple. So he's there, but he's not like holding great, you down. Great. Can you wear him like a backpack? <laughs> I'm just going to tell him, <laughs> stay put. Um, those of you who are in the room, so that's basically everyone except... Kai, um, see little Isala swim down to the gate and kind of like hold onto the bars. Kai, for you, baby. Can't quite get her head out, um, and then she pushes back up into the air. Um, at the and I'll I'll just yell in draconic her to her that we're coming to get her. Wait, so get some air, honey. <laughs> uh, Mina, big breath. You're up. Um, I as my first. Thing, and we're gonna cast a bless with my ring. <laughs> nice, nice. Who are you blessing? Who am I blessing? Uh, who can I bless? Uh, what I think level it's is it? Second level bless. Somebody gave it to me. <laughs> so one of these clerics. I gave it to her a while ago. Yeah, it's second level. Yeah. It's second level. The second level. All right, so you can bless four people. You can bless four people. Amen. Uh <laughs> and it's anyone within thirty feet, so that's any everyone in your party. Yeah. Um including the Triton prisoner, uh Thunin, who is now right by Akir. <clears throat> uh you cannot get Isala or the Locath. Uh, I'm just gonna bless my party. And your are you yourself or just all four of them? Um, uh, can I do? I, I can't do myself, right? You can do four people. You can choose yourself to be one of those four. Okay. I'm gonna. Who do I exclude? This is a very difficult choice for Janine, not for me. <laughs> um, Atreus and Torkel have a plus three on okay. e on their checks and attacks right now. Um, I don't know what Bless does, but if that helps, it adds a D four on top of that. D fours. So I'm going to definitely bust myself because I don't have that. I just have one round of Bardic. Um, I'm going to hashtag bless uh, Atreus because he did such a good job. 
um, marriage my, blessings. I'm gonna bless hashtag bless Kai because we are chaos twins now, and um, uh, Torkel and Akir can do a rock paper. Give it to, to, to Torkel because <laughs> Torkel gets you the know last Akir is like on separate. his own thing that he's doing right now, and All and right, Torkel's like go. right next to the big bad. Hashtag blessed. Um, great. So that happened. Um, now what? <laughs> now you have a move action, mm -hmm. a bonus action, action surge, item interaction. Okay. Um, I feel like I should start killing baddies. Right? So, and the closest one to me is this wave shaper. Is that correct? And you're, you're right next to this We're girl. right next to her. Um, so I'm, uh, can I shield bash this lady? Absolutely. That sounds like a good time. That would catch her off guard. Action surge. <laughs> Action surge. I got a really bad shield bash. That's a 13. What's her AC? <laughs> hold on. Hold on. Hold on. She's a caster. But that is going to, uh, you did cast oh, bless I didn't on yourself. Oh, I that. You're right. See, I already forgot. And I have Bardic. So we're going to just go with the bless first and then we'll save the rest sorry i can't see anything um let's do that oh nice uh so that is a 16. wonderful gonna do some damage that was a six for damage and what's bardic it's a D8. The which D8. you can add to damage. Which you can add to basically add, anything. Add a D8 there for damage. Because that sounds like a good time. Um, And that's five. Can things get knocked Ouch. by prone All right, in so I'm water? taking 11. Yes. Down. So <laughs> then I'm going to need you to make me an athletics right, right, check. Right, you're right. That was a 20, a dirty 20. She sat. I don't I don't think I can. <laughs> she sat. My, uh, 16. So she Blood. is now Blood. smashed down <laughs> at the feet. Uh, so she had already dropped her staff at in some fear. And you just come up behind her with your shield and smash her down. And her head conks against the uh, floor of this place. Yeah, dazed and confused. Um, cool. And so, um, I'm just gonna, I guess, action surge because why not? I'm here. We're having fun. We're, we're having a party. Yeah, fun. So I get a bash slash slash out of this game, but she's well, you get a bash. slash slash. slash. What are you, you pulling the sword or the um, trident? The sword today. I'm gonna take. You have a swim speed, right? I do, speed, because right? I am aquatic elf. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> have a good time. Because we're having a good time. I believe um, all of us have swim speeds at this moment. And so... <clears throat> Kai, yep. Yep, everyone does. And then, so I am slash slashing her at advantage, I'm assuming. At advantage, Are you upset, Ross? <laughs> I had been worried that this was too deadly I just critted on her. He had been worried, <laughs> and now he's worried in the universe. Incredible. Incredible. <laughs> so, she got crits. Uh, oh, I also rolled the wrong... Um, doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's the same bonus to it's hit. It's just now that I have I to... I think it's a crit anyway. The, the damage twice, so give me a second here. Mm-hmm. Oh, give me a crit damage there. She turns to goop. And <laughs> that's twelve. You also get crit um, necrotic damage. Oh right. Okay, so that's twelve from that crit damage. Be right back. Scrolling down. Having a good time. <laughs> I hope you know we're having fun, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> I'm. S that's what. And then that's another thirteen is, for uh, necrotic damage. How's this little friend feeling? <laughs> 
Uh, she's hurt. <laughs> yeah, like a I lot. bet. She's she's her not. Her skin is very starting to melt off. Anything her body. that just happened. Yeah, a lot of her uh, shark scales have literally dissolved. In <laughs> mm -hmm. she's molting, and you get to oh, attack so her fun. again. Here we go again. Yeah. All right, I will click the correct weapon this time. Um. So anyone following along with the bingo card, what just happened was Mina did a shield bash and then critted. So feel free to mark that off on your bingo. Oh, that was a 19. That, that's another crit. Which is a Mina crit. <sighs> Excuse me. Pardon me. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, I'm Ready? I'm pretty happy that you used your Bardic earlier, because then you would have had another double D8. That was four, because I didn't roll twice. And then that is a nine. Be right back, scrolling down. Put out of my way all these things. You might be able to wreck her right here, right now. Oh, that was a nice little... And that's 13 damage of... Still alive. Ow. All right. Well, she's... She's barely a fish. <laughs> she is... She is the most filleted fish you've ever encountered that's Welcome still Welcome to living. the Red Lobster. <laughs> <laughs> the red is from acid or necrotic damage. I was McDonald's? Okay. <laughs> you kill me. <laughs> he slapped oh. a fish. He slapped his head in. Why would you do that? <laughs> uh, I think that's the end of my turn. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Unless I you want really to want swim to somewhere. <laughs> I'm just having a good time. Uh, no, I'm good. I'm going to I'm gonna okay. hang out. You said end of turn. I'm moving up. <laughs> I'm not letting you do anything else to my poor bad guys. Um, and of course, next up in the order is me. I'm so excited because it's a, a Triton and I get to hurt my. Was I supposed oh. to add Bless onto any of those attacks? <laughs> uh, it didn't matter because they okay, all great. crit. Let's check. Yes. But yes, you probably ended up effectively rolling a 30 something to hit. So, you know. Just so you know, you hit them really, really fucking hard. Thank you. I appreciate the, you're the confirmation. Just so mad. <laughs> you're just so Actually, mad I think she's having a lot of fun. She's really mad. <laughs> she like saw Atreus like just go after Macat, and now she's just like, "Oh, this is gonna be a good time." Ooh, this is my brand. <laughs> Carry on. Yeah, it's a good day. <laughs> All right. Um, so, rolling out of his cell, he grabs the sword from uh, Kier and stabs Kier. Um, no, I didn't incite him. Oh, no. you should have. Um, <laughs> he, you, you see him just kind of take his offhand and do one of these motions and these. Spines that had been uh, on him just kind of fly through the water at the uh, general. Do I have any reason for this to be an advantage? No. That's cool. Oh, well, that's garbage. That's an eight to hit. Did that even show up? Yeah. There's no way that's in the general, right? Right? I, I would hope it <laughs> no, doesn't hit the no general. Way. Okay, good. No. And then uh, he's going to swim towards the general with uh, this rapier um, outstretched. That was a 19 that turned into a 9. Uh, so yeah, the 14 is also going to miss as uh, he closes the gap. With the dear general. Um, you see him suddenly like freak out for a moment and uh, kind of dance around the general and move next to the sea lion cage. Um, the sea lion stops its thrashing and uh, 
nuzzles the bars. You're not getting a sea lion pedic here. But why? <laughs> Atreus, you're up. Good. Uh, so the the what's her face is still in front of because I'm right by Mina, yes? Like yes. we haven't really moved. So I just realized as I was just looking over my uh, my character sheet here that I have used all of my third level spells and one of my fourth levels. So <laughs> that's a stressful moment for me. I'm going to cast Spiritual Weapon, because it might as well be up. And, uh... Let me roll that for the ball. But I get to add 1d3 to that, yes? Yes. Okie dokie. None. Two, so that was, this what was is, it, uh, 17 to hit? This was at advantage because she's prone? No, it was not. Ah, so you have less. That's true. So wait, so then, do I, do I, can I put the bless and everything on? What was, what did bless this give me again? So. A d4. D4, okay. So, is that 17 plus... Give me a second. 17, 19 plus D4. 30, 20. It took me a lot to get there, but I got there. Um, how would you like to do this? Um, not as impressively as my wife, apparently. It just, you know, it just comes out and it slices it down and she turns into sushi. So, well, that's done. I do like sushi. I need there's blood in the water. It's ter it's like it's very graphic and pretty. Like, <laughs> it's oh, sorry. Ooh, that's fun. Is it actually is fun or is it fun. fun for you? That's the that's actually fun or just fun for the DM. Um as um you end her, the water itself seems to respond to her death, and the entirety of the room begins turning into a Mina did it. Uh, um it, the whirlpool is five feet wide at the base, so that is, it is already dragging and pulling on Atreus and uh, Mina. Um, and then it just kind of expands up. So anyone passing anywhere near the vortex is going to have to make an athletics check to avoid getting pulled in. Um, anyone who is in the vortex, so that would be Atreus and Mina currently. Um, when they start their turn there, we'll have to make strength saving throws. Okay. So, nothing We're right just, now. You know, happen, but at the beginning of your fun. turn. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, so, you see her body just kind of like erupt as um, <clears throat> this, this explosion of nature just begins to violently take hold of the room. Um, all the weapons that had been dropped are just sucked up instantly into this vortex. So you now have um, one would call it like a shark tornado, but it's more of a weapon <laughs> tornado. Um, you had to throw a shark nado in yeah, there. I was gonna say, would you would you describe it as sort of a shark nado? Um, I would if there were sharks. There no sharks. In it. A sharkless nado. <laughs> There's there are no current. It is a sharkless nado. NATO. So the wave shaper is dead. Um, I'm going to put a big old X on there. Uh, there is now the giant tornado going on. Mm -hmm. 
so that's super fun. And uh, Treyas still has an action. I do. Um, so is there is there still anyone near near me at the moment? Um, not particularly. In so, the middle of a vortex. <laughs> or in the middle of a vortex. So um, you can try and swim away to the general. You can try and swim away to a war priest. You can try and swim past Kai to one of the divers outside. Does uh, the general or the war priest have any damage to them yet or anything? No? Mm, okay. Well, it'll be a regular then toll the dead for one of them. For the general, I guess. Which one? The general. general. Why not? Okay. So that oops, I rolled it before you gave me your wisdom save. I need a wisdom save from you. It needs to be a seventeen. It's not are you not wise? It's a fourteen. Oh, okay. 14. Oh, stunning. Uh so that yeah. was does bless and the D three count on this? No, it doesn't. Damn it. Well, okay, have nine points of damage anyway, though, so it's not great, but it's something. Don't you have a bardic that you never used? Mina has bardic. I don't no, think I did. You gave a you gave no you gave Atreus bardic while we were driving because I gave Atreus bardic for you and Atreus never used it. Was that in this true. day? Yes, it was right when we walked. It was right before we walked down the stairs to the shape changer. Okay. Does that mean I get to re-roll that? You can add a D8 or, or add you a can D8? save it for future problems. You know what? I'm going to add a D8 because... Do I not? Uh, not? Nine plus four is maths uh, 13. 13. Nice. Yes. I want you to stop making fun of me. The fact that I have to think through I math. I just think it's funny that you declare that you're going to do math before doing the math. <laughs> I have to put myself in the mindset of like the mathematics. Like, Brain, please go into math Is that not a thing mode? that most people do? I just, I have to. I love that you do the math because I just let everyone else do it. <laughs> I go from my regular brain to my math brain. I don't own one of those. <laughs> I can do fourth grade math. I figured most people announced that they did math before they did math. Thank you. Normal human. Stop yeah. making fun of me. I'm going to eat my pickles. <laughs> Carry on. All right. Anything else from Atreus? Nope. You're good there? I'm good. All right. Okay. Um, first up is the scared Shahogan. He's going to run away. He cannot run anywhere except press himself up against the Lokath prisoner. <laughs> but now the Lokath prisoner can attempt to, I don't know, tail slap him. I pretty restrained. Um... Following that is the not frightened war priest. And he's going to cast a spell. And it's going to make me very happy. So let's open this in a new tab. I'm I'm feeling a con save coming on. <laughs> um I'm just going to read the spell description. You open a gateway to the dark between the stars, a region infested with unknown horrors. A 20-foot radius sphere of blackness and bitter cold appears, centered on a point within range and lasting for the duration. This void is filled with a cacophony of soft whispers and slurping noises that can be heard throughout the room. No light, magical or otherwise, can illuminate the area and creatures fully within the area are blinded. The void creates a warp in the fabric of space, and the area is difficult terrain. Any creature that starts its turn in the area is going to take some damage. Anyone that ends its turn in the area will have to take a dex save or take more damage as 
things protruding from other planes slowly reach in and touch you. Why? Whose choice was this? Gross. I don't so, like it. Whose horse is that? Yeah. <laughs> I thought this was way more fun to read aloud than to just say it, it is. happens. You know, um, I think you're enjoying reading it out loud a little too much. <laughs> Look, I practice some things. We're gonna go over here to my paint a circle. Five, 10, 15, 20. So that's it. 10 foot. That's 15. That's 20. Now you're just showing off. Just a little bit. He got upset at how well we were doing. <laughs> it's true. Listen, it's okay to lose poorly. <laughs> it is, but it's way more fun to win when you're Add not expecting some dignity. it. Man. I don't think he has that. <laughs> We'll all be okay. I'm gonna make it all in the darkness. So you know that mm -hmm. the frightened people are not going to be able to see Torkoal. Mm hmm And then can re-roll their wisdom saves. Mm-hmm. You asshole. These are very smart creatures that you guys um, are messing with. If I'm in there, do I still get blind sight though? Yeah. I'll play though. Yes. We all float down here. Shut up, Dex. <laughs> this is being very annoying. I'm very sorry, people who are listening, who can't see any of what I'm doing. I can't see what you're doing, and I'm pissed off. Yup. There we go. All right. I will go ahead and put a screenshot up for you guys. Yeah, I was so going to say, I need to know where I stand. Who's been blinded and who can see what. If you cannot see your character, it means you're in the middle of the things. So let's drop that. That's a that's a big circle. Let me check and make sure it did say twenty foot radius, right? I don't like the circle. It's a it's radius a twenty foot radius. It's yeah. huge. Well shit. Wait. Yeah, that's a twenty foot radius. Radius, so. not diameter. Well, fuck. Right. This is the same size as a fireball, except it doesn't go away. I don't. How do like we get it, it to go away? Who casted this? Whose spell uh, is that? One of the people. This is over by the um, little girls. Um, yeah, it's the spot. war mage. The only one that wasn't frightened. Yeah. <sighs> yep. So. That's fun. And uh, Nathan, would you mind reading me that little bit about fear? So now no one can see. Yeah, so... No one who's afraid of you I can believe, see. Let so, me double check. I believe that means at the end of their turn, they'll get an opportunity to make a wisdom save. Must that take the dash action, move away from you by the safest available route... Unless there's nowhere to move, if the creature ends its turn in a location where it doesn't have line of sight to you. Which is, sounds a little bit different than can't see you, but doesn't have a line of sight to you. The creature can make a wisdom saving. Line of sight. Okay. Yeah. On a successful save, the spell ends for that creature. So they have to run this turn, and if they can't see me, then they get a chance to save. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. So it's not an automatic no. save. 
This is a lot more powerful than I remember. It it's I'm really glad when things like this work because it's so contingent on the rolls going your way. Otherwise, it feels like you wasted a spell slot. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. Within 120 feet of it. Yeah, it's fine. Alright, um, that's going to end their turns. Um, and because the one who was scared went first, it doesn't get to save this turn. Uh, the Blade Master, our dear general, is going to walk away a whole like five feet because that's all he can do because he's all stuffed in there. And he's going to get to make his wisdom save. Just really not ideal for him. But a 19 will do it. Well, that's unfortunate. Damn it. General, back in the game. What were you saying wasn't ideal for him? That he has a zero oh. to this. Yeah. He really sh It's all the dice. So, but he lost an entire turn here. So that was worth a spell slot. Yeah. Also. All right. Uh, the deep divers look at the vortex. They look at the darkness. And they say, yeah, no thank you. Um, they're going to swim over to Kai and start attacking Kai. Um, Kai, do you have all of your hit points? I do. What is that? I don't know. What is it? That's so fun. Um, the I first one comes up. Um, it kind of like its eyes glow and you see this like tentacle kind of come over top of its head and glow with this really beautiful light. And I'm going to need you to make a wisdom saving throw. Versus charmed. I don't know okay. if you have advantage versus charm. But... I do not. Does bless help me here? Bless does help you here. Okay. Okay, so that's a 17 without bless. And then... Um, with bless... That would be a 21. The The light's very pretty, but it doesn't seem to really phase you. Yeah, it's not blue. It's too bad. It's not blue. Um, the other one is going to roll up on you, uh, take its trident, and start attacking you. Cool. So that's going to be one attack. Guessing a nine is going to miss. Correct. It does a 14. 14 is not going to hit you. It is not going to hit, no. Assuming, we're going to assume that I walked into this with my shield on. Because I'm yep. not an idiot. Exactly. Cool. Uh, it's not hovering necessarily, but it's on. Yeah. And then uh, Nat 1, as it tries to bite you. <laughs> no, that ain't going to do shit. Well, I thought they were going to be helpful. They should just leave um, the because they're so unhelpful and they shame. They should have. They're I, so I personally garbage. don't want them to leave because in theory that means that they could go get other people. Oh, that is, that's true. I would like them to die here and not get anybody right, else. Right. No survivors. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Good. Yeah. Wow, they're, we're they're dark. They're done. That was... <laughs> 
Uh, the tornado vortex continues to churn angrily. We're, we're assaulting a so fortress. So here's my question for you. Is the tornado vortex within the darkness yep. sphere? Mm -hmm. What impact is that having on the darkness sphere? None. Okay. It just means you don't know how big the tornado is if you go into the darkness. You cannot see the tornado. You feel the tornado, but you don't see the tornado. Okay. So, all right. Cool, cool, cool. All right. Um, the Locath is chained down and is going to try and... Try and... Uh, what? It's just going to try and melee this thing. Disadvantage. Because it's restrained heavily. Thirteen? Is not enough. Alright. Kai! Okay. You cannot see anything to the right. You can still see the empty cell where Thunin was, but you have lost line of sight on all of your allies yeah. and all of your enemies except for the two divers next to you. And I know that there's a tornado going on. Yes. You assume there's a tornado going on. All right. Does it appear that anybody has picked up on everything going on here? Uh, no. This has been a whopping, like, four seconds, so cool. there doesn't seem to be any patrol alert or anything. And you, as you remember, the arena is in the middle of this it's very beautiful, loud. loud battle. So. Yeah, 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 okay. Um, all right. Will you allow this? I saw the vortex mm -hmm. before the sphere of darkness. Yep. If I have a thing that vortexes in the opposite direction... Will you allow it to cancel out that vortex? If it is a generally equal power, yes. Um, a five-foot cube of air. Yep. No. You could... That I could... You could basically make one little space safe within the vortex. But then I could add, like dust and shit to it and pebbles and shit and make it powerful because it can um it can grow up to a 10 foot radius cloud of debris until the start of my next turn so you yeah so you can either go against it and stop a specific area from being this battering vortex, or you can add to it and make it extra boomy. If I go against it, would it be enough to stop like everyone from taking damage? Everyone in that little spot, yeah. From the tornado. And how big was the tornado? Uh, it was... Like five foot, ten foot, twenty feet, then it was up in the ceiling. Just so by doing this, you would basically make the area where your allies were on the floor safe from the tornado. Yeah, that would be good. Let's do that. <clears throat> 
<clears throat> we are going to cast Dust Devil. We are going to use the air that was in Thunin's cell because I need air in order to do it. Mm -hmm. um, and then we are going to center it. We're going to move it. Um, Now, is there air closer to me? Your breath. You want to pop your bubble? If you pop your bubble, I've got the potion of water breathing. I can just toss that at you. But, but we might need it for our babies. Yeah. <sighs> the babies will just have to swim fast. <sighs> Cure can also so recast the pocket it, but of... it's not concentration. The pocket of air at the top of Thunan's thing. Is it the it's whole like top of 40 his? 40 feet away. 40 feet? Oh, it's a 60 foot range. I thought it was 30. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay, cool. So we're going to cast it there. We're going to pull it in. And in doing so, it's going to bring in um, any kind of um, sand, dust, loose dirt, and small gravel. And it's going to suck all that up. And it's going to form a 10-foot radius cloud of debris. Um, so it is going to have a radius half the size of the dark sphere yep um and everyone who ends their turn within five feet of the devil has to make a strength saving throw um on a failed save they will take 1d8 bludgeoning damage and be pushed 10 feet away so the benefit of that is if you fail you actually get out of the circle of darkness you're welcome um but so on it's not going to do damage but neither is the neither tornado. is the other thing that's fair so they're gonna just kind they're of gonna cancel, cancel each, each other, other out. out that's fair yeah so at least now you don't have to deal with the image cool so now we can at least swim through that without having to do a whole bunch of other stuff. Um, and for an item interaction, did I happen to see, I guess the, the shape, the waves changers, staff got pulled into the yeah into it's the lost darkness, to me into the at this point. yeah it's gone okay all right i think i am going to end my turn there nice are you you're not moving you're staying where you are um yeah i don't really want to go into the thing for now all right sounds like a plan See if I can send this back. Yeah, look at that. That's not bad at all. All right. Um, next up is the champion who is scared and has to run away. He runs back to the corner by Isala. Now he gets to make his saving throw. Ridiculous amount of awesome. 18. Go back to the 18. Don't give me a 13. He's still scared. 
All right. Ladies and gentlemen, that was one whole round of combat. What was it? An hour and a half of combat? Jesus. It was just shy of an hour. Torkel, felt so long. you're up here. You're on deck. So here, get ready to do what you want to do. And by just um, shy an of an now. hour, we mean that was six seconds. Um, <laughs> so like okay. so, 100 times longer? Something like that. Uh, so anyway, I am... Let's see. So I'm going to take... I still got Sanctuary on me. I'm going to take the Thieves tools from Akir. I got I got the Thieves tools. Wait, Actually... You're starting in the darkness. Yeah, how do you see? Did I see him move to where I was and hold the mouth? You know where out? he is, yes. I, I saw him hold them out. So... Okay, so... You're going to take 2d6 cold damage. Okay, so let's start with damage. Okay. All right, seven, seven cold damage. Okay. Fear is a concentration spell, correct? It is. You need a constitution saving throw. Don't do me like this. You have bless. I've got I've got bless and I've got an acorn if I need it. You need to and hit you ten. have a plus three. That's is the plus three on saving throws? That's an eleven. Uh, so do I need checks? Actually, that's a You're fifteen. Fine. So You're I don't fine. need to roll anything else. Yep. Cool. Um. All right, is that all the beginning of turn effect stuff I need to worry about? Correct. Cool. Because the vortex has been effectively disabled. Sweet. So can I grab? Can I grab the thieves' tools from Akir then? Do I need? Absolutely. Okay, I'm gonna grope around, grab the thieves' tools, and then I am going to go in what I know is the direction of Isala's cell. And I am going to try and open it. I guess I'm gonna have to pass Makat. No, he's a, he's he's so he's hiding in the corner, isn't he? He is down in this. You don't know where. He well, went. okay. Well, I'm going over to yeah. the cell because that was the Five, game plan. Ten, fifteen to get the. He's got sixty feet um, of movement with the manta ray cloak. If... Oh, that's true. I have the manta ray cloak. I forgot about that. Thank you. Swim, 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 so it's swim. Difficult terrain. Okay. So is that 10, 20, 30 feet to get to a keer? Okay. 10, 20, 30 feet to get back to where you are. Okay. So you are still. <gasps> Which means no one can see you. You okay. can. Yep. Oh, jeez. Then maybe that's not what I want to do. Now nah, I'm just, okay. Forget that. I'm just gonna get out of the darkness, and I'm gonna I'm gonna scare those people back in the corner where they belong. Um, nice. Which I guess will drop sanctuary, but no. Oh, you're not recasting. No. You're just becoming visible again. No, Got it. I'm I'm just gonna, I'm just getting yep. out of the darkness. I can't even talk to Asala, so yeah. I'm just so you take a gonna be there and look formidable. Step. There you go. Yeah, uh, you're you're basically right next to the Triton. Okay, and and he and I are on the same page. Yeah, you know yeah. that that's all I uh, I've got one more. Card. I can you have a full finish. action bonus action. You've done nothing. I know, but any very almost anything I do risks breaking my sanctuary, and that's not what I want to do right now. <laughs> it's true. No killing so... baddies. No, I'm 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 just gonna keep as many people hiding in a corner and having difficulty to hit me as possible. Right, because if they can't like, if they can't see any other enemies and they attack Torkoal, like if they fail wisdom saving throws, which we already know Macat has a plus zero, he's just right. gonna waste his attacks. Yeah. Um Mina, you've used your Bardic, right? You can't Correct. see anyone okay. else. Um a creature that can hear me gains inspiration, Ooh. so it doesn't matter if I can see them. Nice. nice. Um, yeah, I mean, I have some more, and that, and with that, I'm out of bardic inspiration until short rest. 
And I'm just going to end my turn just looking scary. Uh, do you want to make an intimidation check? Do you want to make a uh, take the dodge action or ready an action? Actually, I'm going to I'm going to taunt Makat to try to try and hit me. <laughs> like, come on, big man, come on, big man! I dare you to hit me. But he can't Let's understand go. you. Well, he might be able to. You don't know. Listen, oh, you can you can understand shit talking in every language. Exactly. Okay? Toko's just up there. Come Flip on, him bring off. Him, big uh, guy. You hear him go, I plan to. <laughs> in common. Well, what was that? He, uh, he said, I plan to. In in common. All right. Good. He is Let's not your go. everyday shahawi. Let's go. All right. That's it. <laughs> We go right, get fucked. Akira is up with the sea lion on deck and Mina after the kids. What you gonna do, Birdman? This... Other than take two d six cold damage. Yeah, I guess. Uh, what's that roll that I need? Or do I just take the damage? You just you take six cold damage. All right, I'll just take that. I'm not. Gonna Are you waste. concentrating on pass without a trace? I am. So give me a concentration check on that. That's constitution, right? Yep, constitution saving throw. You are not blessed. Dirty 20. But you are fine. Yep. All right, proceed. Um, ooh, priorities. The... Am I able to grab Thunin and drag him out of here? So that he does not get wrecked by the darkness. You can certainly try. I would like to grab Thunin and just go straight backwards from where we came. All right. Um, because he was touching you, I will give you advantage on this attack roll, even though you can't see him. So make an athletics check. And he is going to try and fight you because he doesn't actually know what's that's, going on. That's fair. You said at advantage. At advantage. Okay. So you know where he's at and he is scared of you. 24. I win. Five. By you a got lot. It. Yep. All right. But since we're in the darkness, I can only go, what, 15 feet, I guess? Yep. Although, does my. This probably does not affect this, but my land stride. Moving through non-magical... No, it's non-magical. Never magical. mind. Yep. Yep. So you can okay. move five. And 15. You can get yourself to the edge of the darkness. Dragging him. Basically just shoving him along and he will be out of the darkness. Right. That is where I want him. So, like... But you are I'm still, still in it, it though. You're at the edge of it. You have another attack, and you have your bonus action. But I can't see anyone. Nope. Do not like this. Can I use Zephyr Strike and move back to the eel cage? Is that a concentration spell? It is. You certainly can if you're dropping past with that yep. trace. I'm going to use Zephyr Strike at first level. And then I'm going to move back to the eel cage. I'm guessing because I made a grapple, I'm not going to be able to try and unlock the eel cage yeah that was okay. your action or that was yeah. an attack um yeah you can try and attack it if you want to draw your magical sure. weapon or something yeah let's do that i'll attack it with my rapier all right we have disadvantage to hit it just try and bust this stuff down because 
discretion is no longer a thing. <laughs> That's a 19. Yeah, that, that hits. Because my, my plus 10 is just makes it hard to miss things. Mm -hmm. You should see my bow. Yep. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> Good. Um, and I'm also going to put my Zephyr Strike damage on this because it's forced damage, and I feel like that is an effective use. That's that's smart. So, oh, we're going to max that damage for a 14, and then we're going to add the D8 for Zephyr Strike. Almost max, so 21 damage. It has a damage threshold of 15, so if you didn't do 15, it did zero. Because you passed it, it takes all of it, and you shatter the lock off. Nice. Um, I'm guessing I'm probably um, out of yeah. movement speed at this point, or at least I should be. So I'm going to end my turn here. All right. Now I need you to make me a dexterity saving throw. As you feel a tentacle kind of start wrapping around 27. <laughs> it doesn't. It just doesn't. Sorry, Dex is Dex is also my my bread and butter over here. So <laughs> yeah, sure, I said I'm sorry, but okay, I'm not. Is sorry. there anything I'm not you're sorry at all. bad at? Uh, constitution, <laughs> because it seems like all of your modifiers are plus ten. Constitution and intelligence, <laughs> things I do not do unless I absolutely have to. Fair enough. So you're not you're not intelligent. Got it. No, I'm wise. I'm not intelligent. I mean, it's, I'm not like not intelligent. I just have a plus one. Uh. <laughs> oh. All right, Mina, you're up in a moment. Um, the sea lion is going to kind of sit and it looks like he's waiting um, as if uh, somehow the triton is speaking to him. I want to break free. <laughs> That's what he's saying. Yep. Um, the that was singing is... for our bingo player. <laughs> it will always be singing in my part. Thunin is terrified. Um, he's looking around, really doesn't know what's going on, sees Kai, and tries to get close to Kai, but uh, can't really. So it's just going to get near the exit where he can see a person who's fighting the Shahaugen. A stranger who is also looks like a Shahaugen, but is fighting the Shahaugen. So That's probably not a Maybe a bad person? <laughs> I don't know. He just hugged Shahaugen Akir. So, like... Yeah. He's doing it. It's okay. fine. It's a lot of confusion for this. All guy. he knows is there's a <laughs> because... group that is attacking the people mm -hmm. who are capturing him. And therefore, for now, they're exactly. good. The enemy of my enemy is my friend. If they Our... stab him later, then, yep. oh, that sucks. Figure it out. Exactly. Uh, you saw it does the same thing. Uh, it takes a breath and waits. Mina, okay. you're up. And I'm in this darkness, which I can see a little bit in. You can see what's directly around you, which would be Atreus. your uh, Atreus. Um, and you can see Akir has come, has left and came okay. back. But um, you also know that Thunin is no longer with Akir. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Um... And you're going to take some cold damage. Okay. Ooh, nice. 11. I don't like when you cheer against me. It hurts my feelings. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It was 11 points. <laughs> um, okay. And then what do I got to do to get out of this place? Uh, swim. Just keep swimming. <laughs> Just keep can swimming. I dash? You can definitely can get dash. Get out of here? Okay. Yep. Which way would you like to uh, go? I would like to go towards like the the loft cat. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 10, 20, 30. So you can get to the edge without dashing. Mm -hmm. And then if you dash, you're going to bump into Hi, the Hi, fucker! <laughs> yep. Um, okay, cool, cool. Dash, cool. shield bash? Dash, shield bash. Can I do a dashed shield bash? You... <laughs> is, is that extra? <laughs> Audience, do you want her to do a dash and shield bash? Of course they do. 
Dex, Dex, I don't know. Maybe you? some Dex of them want me to have like, Absolutely. <laughs> Anyone? Anyone? Are you, you're just going to... Yes. <laughs> that was Cat. <laughs> that doesn't count. That does not <laughs> count, Cat. <laughs> I was hoping Rob would not see that. <laughs> now someone just has to create a fake account. There, there we go. Dex said dash and dash. Fine. Yes, thank you. Thank you, Dex. 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 Do a bonk. <laughs> and Max. Max CMY. Anyway. Yeah, yeah. Give me that shield bash. Is this just a straight roll? Or... It's a regular attack roll, and you have bless on top Hashtag of it. Hashtag bless. Okay, so that was an 18. I'm just going to throw a bless on there for fun. That's a d4, right? Yep. Okay, it's a 19. Uh, that misses. That misses? A 19 misses him? Uh-oh. Yes. We have to just ignore him and get the kids out and go. Isn't he the one doing the darkness? We kill him. No, no it's the no, guy with we... the staff. <clears throat> this is this is the guy in charge of the entire army and the assault on the lizard folk. Oh, he's he's a waste of my time then. No, he yeah. needs to die. He needs <laughs> no, to he die. needs to die, babe. Oh, babe, okay, I'll keep please. hitting him then. No. Oh, God. Oh. All right. <laughs> Moving on. All right. So now I get a slash slash, yes? No, no, you, you dashed. I dashed. Okay, so there I am. That's what you got. Okay. Yep. That's good. Go. Um, you, you spring your shield down, and he just takes one of his forearms and grabs it and stops it. Sorry for the squeaky chair. Um, Triton's coming up. Atreus, you're on deck. So the Triton is going to take... The weapon that Akir handed him and try and break this lock and bust out his buddy. Good news, that hits. Is there anything special about this rapier? Uh, this one, no. This was just a regular rapier. Ah, yeah, the rapier that's... of regular. I've heard of its wonders. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> realizing that's not going to work, um, he is going to kind of like say something in Aquan to his little buddy and uh, go chase down the champion. And he's going to attack the champion. Mm -hmm. he's, gonna, he's gonna miss. That's alright. Alright, this guy is not on his best day here. Alright, Atreus, you're up. Cool. Um, I'm going to... Can I run out of darkness here? After you take some cold damage, oh, you certainly don't may want to take try. cold damage. Nobody likes the cold that much. Five points of cold damage. Mm. Since I'm like a vampire, does the cold actually? No, just, I won't. I won't try to yes, cull in the, my way the out cold of this. Bothers you okay. anyway? Shh! I want to be Elsa. Shh. Um. All right, so I've taken five points of cold damage. Can I please to run out of this darkness? And you can get with your movement to the edge. So you will have to dash if you want to get out. I want to dash then. Uh, you are now, you move like just a few more feet. Uh, you're next to Mina and Makat. Cool. You can move a little more if you'd like um, or stop there at the edge. So I would know that it's the the staffy guy who got the uh who did the darkness yes yes okay well um mina seems to have makat under control i trust her i'm going mm -hmm. to swing the oldie spiritual weapon at staff guy Kill that is like wizard. 40 50 feet away can i please fine <laughs> 
fine. Flirting with the DM <laughs> when it's your husband will get you things. It's true. It will. You guys can't try. But he responds to my Disney princess eyes. <laughs> yeah, it's not fair. Oh, well. All right. Swing, swing. Uh, 16. Oh, wait, but I still have bless, bless yes. And the D3. You have bless. So let's, and just, the D3. let's just add bless to that first. That was D4, yes? Mm-hmm. Okay, so that's a 19. And let me put in the... Uh... Yeah, now that's that's going to hit. All right. Hit me. <clears throat> I will. And here I am hoping the darkness is concentration. That's uh, 13 points of damage. going to make a concentration saving throw. That's a 10. Boom. Darkness stays up. Damn it! What? I tried, though, with my flirting with the DM. Atreus is not afraid to be a slut. Um, <laughs> that's all I can do because I dashed. Right? is definitely afraid to be a slut. That's it. Atreus is afraid to be a slut. I'm not! <laughs> Correct. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get this right for the record. But only with my husband. Let's also get that right for the record. Mina, um, as a trace, his wife knows that he's 100% afraid to be a slut. <laughs> Atreus, like Amelia, is only a slut for their spouse. <laughs> um, is there anything else I can do? Because I, you can move a little I mean, more, I but dash, that's really. So, like, I can't really do any it. other. Mm. Yeah. I'm going to stay where I am. All righty. Actually, no, just kidding. I am going to move a little bit closer because I did cheat with the spiritual weapon just a wee bit. So, I'll get closer to my target. Feel better? A little bit. Thank you. You're welcome. Where Mina belongs, Torkoal back where he belongs. Torkoal's back in line of sight, so this war priest doesn't even get a chance to save. He stands and cowers in the corner. All right, the other one. Um, that's concentration. That's concentration. That's concentration. Just, just drop the darkness. Just just drop it. Yeah. Uh, it is going to try and kill the Triton who stepped up next to him. Triton has taken damage. Has he? No, he hasn't. Lame. Alright, he's going to bite him. Yep, that hits. That's a shame. Seven, 17 four. for those listening. Four whole damage. Four damage. And now, um, Ouch. taking his staff, he's gonna, like, smack it on the ground, and you watch a little mechanical blade flash out the top, and he's going to spin that around and try and slash... The Triton with that, and now because he's bleeding, he has advantage. It's also going to hit six seven damage. What is this? And yes, we can constitution saving throw. Oh dear. Oh. Um, you watch the blade wrap up around the Triton's uh, throat and uh, he begins choking. And uh, he drops 
Akira's rapier and falls to his knees, just grabbing at his throat. Well, that's not good. That seems not good. And now it is General McCott's turn. All right, let's go, buddy. Um, he can't get to you because Mina and oh. Atreus have put themselves in the way. So he's going to Aww. try and take out Atreus to get to Torkoal. What if Atreus just like moves out? <laughs> Atreus, do you have all of your hit points? No, because I gave I cold do damage. not have all of them. Does 23 hit you? You're just so mean. Yes. All right. You don't have shield to stop that? I don't think e shield would not even stop that. No. Because that's... Wait, how much is that? Hang on. What's your AC? Wait. You have a shield, don't you? Oh, wait. Shield, sh it, it would... My AC is 18. Um, yeah, so shield wouldn't do it. No, from Night Render, it would because uh, it's a plus five and it would meet it. Never mind. So yep. I'm not even going to use it. <sighs> so you're going to take 10 points of damage. Yeah. Mina, do you want to do anything about this? I'm fine, babe. I'm just bleeding a little bit, but I'm fine. I'd like to hit him, though, because that sounds like a good time. I do appreciate swing, it. Swing, swing. Um, how many how many actions do I get this as a sentence? This is just one, one swing, swing, just one stabby stab. Okay. Um, here we go. Uh, that was a twenty-two, and that gets bless on top. Please add the bless. Twenty-four. 24 will hit. Fabulous. <laughs> I would like to hit him. <laughs> um, uh, he gets 10 points of regular damage. And then he gets four more points of necrotic. Just kind of snarls at you and then hits your husband oh. again. <laughs> Uh, 15 is not going to hit a trace. It's because I stabbed him. Good yeah, job, babe. Apparently. I love you. <laughs> and there's another 23 to hit a trace. It's the magic number right there. No. <laughs> is there a better number? Atreus. Take eight more points of Ooh, damage. Fuck. Okay. How you doing, Atreus? Oh, I'm I'm fine. Oh. Super good. All right, uh, that's. Oh wait, he's got another claw. Oh, fuck. Sorry, he's got four arms. Mm. Four forearms. Four elbows. So I much. I mean, each biceps. arm could have multiple elbows, for all we know. Twenty-two to hit. Um, not when I'm using the one chance that I have to use Night Render's shield. All right, then. Yeah. Um, Night Render shines forth from your back, and his claw just kind of, in the same way, um, he had stopped his shield. Your shield just kind of stopped his claw, and he was, "I'm coming for the dwarf." Try. He's trying. <laughs> Um, oh, I'm so sorry. Is okay. that what you were doing? We'll just scoot right out of your way. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Um, or who has we're the going... highest HP of all of us? Yeah. yeah. Have at him. Yeah. Um, here come the deep divers. It's going to be a whole bunch of attacks against Kai. Kai, you still have all your hit points? Sure do. First one. Does a 14 hit? No. Nope. Second one. 20 hits. Yep.
You're going to take 21 points of damage. What kind of damage? Uh, this is slashing. Okay. I Sorry, this is piercing because raised. it's the trident. Oh, well. Yep. All right. And then we're going to have the next one attacking at advantage because now you're bleeding. Nineteen to hit. That'll do it. And second attack. You take eleven from that one. Okay. And eighteen to hit. Yep. You take another 11. Lovely. The wave shaper is dead. The locath is going to try a very pathetic attack here. To punch something. That's a big mess. All right, Kai, you are up. All right. Being half dead changes things slightly. So, I think Everyone who's over by the low calf, there's a lot of people um, who would be hit if I moved my dust devil, right? There's a lot of allies mixed with enemies over there, yeah. yeah. I guess I should probably, I probably have to make a save to make sure I still have it up now that I've been hit, right? Yes, you need three constitution saving throws. Each of them, DC 10. Well, the first one's fine. Yep. And the second one's fine. Wow. Are you rolling D20s or just 20s? It it says D20s. And the last one's fine, fine too. Wow. Wow. Oh, boy. All right, so it is still up. Um, the question is, yeah, no, Kai is panicking and is going to drop it because they're going to rage. All right. Um, so let's mark that off. Let us roll our D8. To see what chaos we create. Hmm. That's fun. We got an eight. Ooh. Which is... A bolt of light shoots from my chest. Another creature of my choice that I can see within 30 feet must succeed on a con save. Or take 1d6 radiant damage and be blinded until the start of my next turn. Until my rage ends, I can use this effect again on each... Each of my turns as a bonus action. Nice. Hell so yeah! You can, you can roll out the uh, Iron Man um, assault here. Uh-huh. So I you have, love you have two... This is too good. Two Wave Shapers, or two of the Divers right next to you. Which one do you want, A or B? And they are the only ones I can see currently, correct? correct. Yep. Uh, let's go for A. All right. I mean, the Constitution saving throw? Yes. And the DC. That's in that 20. Oh, damn it. This 
The DC for what it's worth is a 16. But nice. um so he's okay for this time. All right. All right. It's the angly uh, thing. He's got that little uh, glowy yeah. thing. It just kind of makes sense that he's fine. Yeah. Yeah. So, all right. Well, hopefully we'll get him next time. There you go. Um, all right. So I am now raging. And I'm very pissed at these two. Uh, so we are going to uh, attack them. Um. Oh. And we're going to do so with our vicious rapier. Nice. Uh, because it is magic. Are you going to recklessly attack so you have advantage? Uh, sure. I'll we'll do that. that again. So, yeah. That's better. That will hit. Okay. You going on A? Just all the way? Yeah, let's just keep going on A. So that's five points of magical piercing damage. Yep. Um, Multi-attack? Yep. Extra attack. And that'll do that again. Nice. Eh, that's not so great, but that's still four points of magical piercing damage. There you go. Um, and I I cannot speak to the child. Unless you can speak Draconic. I can! You could speak to the child. You, you can speak Draconic. Um, That's helpful. I can! All right. Huh. I didn't know I could, but I can! <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say I couldn't, but it turns out I can. Um, would I be able, as my movement, to grab the child and move through the the blackness or no because Where that would... are you trying to take him i'm trying to get i'm trying to go the shortest possible route through the um through the black like to get to where i th hear everyone else so but by um yasala's thing so basically like just through that very edge right there wasn't he already so in you're the trying healing? to drag him towards where the enemies are no he's out i'm trying to get our group back together so that we can talk and actually get out because you guys don't know where i am and we don't know where you are um you are out of attacks, so you could move to him, but you could not, like, grapple okay. him and pull him anywhere. All right, then I will just wait where I am. All right. All right. Uh, it is the champion's turn. Uh, I think he's still scared. Turkle, do you remember? I think the only... Um, I believe the only one who has made the save is Makat. That's what I thought. So um, he's just going to stand there and cry. Um, that's all he can do. Him and all of his hit points are just weeping. So, All right. Uh, we are at the top of the order. It is 10-11. So we are going to attempt to get through one more full round of combat before we call it for the night. Um, aiming for ending at 10.30. So, if it's not your turn and you're not on deck like Peter is, uh, if you need to run to the restroom, feel free to go do that. So, Torkoal's up. Akira's on deck. Do we need an updated All map? Alright. Um, yeah, that wouldn't hurt. Not too much has changed. Um, 
high is the one feeling the worst right now, but I think high is probably too far away from me for it to make sense for me to go there. I'm also yeah. like generally okay ish. I'm raging now, so I'm I'm okay ish. That's good to know. Um let me just let me just check in on the map. I'm really disinclined to do anything that's going to drop drop my sanctuary. But what that means is that I can cast uh cure wounds on Atreus at let's go with second level since Atreus has taken hits for me. Pause. Seems like the least I can do. As you do that, the scared war priest um, reaches out and you watch the healing magic get sucked away. Well, that's rude. Did you just bitch. counter spell a healing spell? Yes. By a frightened person? <laughs> he can still use Is reactions. Is he doing specifically because it was on me? That's bullshit. I've been holding on to this for so long. He he can even do that for touch range. Yep, anything in sixty feet. Is Actions. <sighs> well, that's so. Mark off the spell slot because it's spent. Yeah, I marked off the spell slot. Actually, didn't, but now I did. Um. Great. I don't. I don't have anything to do against that, do I? No. Well? Jerk. <laughs> Fine, well, I'm just gonna stare daggers at that mofo. Get, stay in that corner. Stay in that corner. He's just Jerk. shaking. Good! As he should be. Like a little, Like a little scared Sith or something, just... Hmm. Okay. Fine. Well, then not using any more of that at any point in the future. Um. Well, I, you know, I guess that about does it. <laughs> All right. The cure is because I mean that was my that was my action. So. Oh well. Yep. Aki now you know. The cure is up. Mina is soon after. Akir, you are taking 2d6 hold. Lay it on me. Ten! Um... Yeah, I'll just take it. You have concentration on... Is that for strike still, or you used it all already? I'm, I mean, the effect's still there, because I can still move without opportunity attack, so I'll roll for it. That's a 16. All right. Yep, good. Um, so this door's open. I guess I'm going to move towards the bad guys because that's that's the next objective here. I know I'm not... Well, I can assume I'm not going to be able to see much inside the eel cage because I don't know how far this darkness ranges. I'll just have to assume everywhere is darkness. Um, so I'm going to move towards bad guys until I find something. What is your swim speed? 30. Alright, you can use your movement to get to the edge of the darkness. Uh, you don't see anything Can't yet. Can't see anything yet? Okay. In that case, am I able to re-equip my shield and cast Shield of Faith? Not Shield of Faith. That one. No, never mind. That's concentration. Well, yeah. Can I re-equip my shield and cast Shield of Faith, even though Shield of Faith is a bonus action? Definitely, because re-equipping the shield is your action. Um, shield of Faith doesn't require you to see anybody. I was just going to cast it on myself. Yeah, okay. I'll, I'll let that go. 
And then I'll need a dexterity saving throw for ending your turn in the darkness. Sounds good. Yeah, Shield of Faith just says, surrounds a creature of your choice within range. Which is a nice. very broad definition. All right, so yep. that's cast. You can... Could have popped it on one of the kids. I thought about that, but as far as I know, Thunin is as far away as possible from any enemies, and Yusla is still in her cage, so I'm not as worried about them right now. So, deck save. Ouch. Nat 1, which is still a 10, but Nat 1. You don't have anything to add to that? I don't think so. Nope. All right. That is going to fail. Barely. But enough. And you're going to take... duty 6 acid damage. So, 8 points of acid as you feel a tentacle actually kind of caress across your bare legs. There were probably so many better ways to describe that. My bare <laughs> legs. Um, I'm going to use my Ooh, reaction caressing. and absorb yeah. that damage. All right. You take four acid damage, and your next attack will have acid damage. And that's going to be second level, so I'll do 2d6 next round. Ooh, yeah. Nice. All right. Um, the sea lion doesn't do anything. Neither of the lizard folk children do anything. They're just sitting there waiting. Um, Kai can see uh, Thunin just kind of like shivering. He's looking to them for some sort of signal of what to do, but just is essentially dodging and hoping nothing attacks. Mina, you're up. Atreus is up soon. All right. <clears throat> um, do I know who's casting the darkness? You were able to see at that time, so yeah, it's the priest in the back by Isala's. That's all um, the way over there. Yeah. Um, can I get past the sky to go over there, or not? You will get an opportunity attack, but. <laughs> I'm going to risk it, because he wants to get to Torkoal anyway, and I just need to get the fuck out of his way. Yeah. <laughs> so you're going to move through the trace's space. So that's ten. Like through his legs. <laughs> yep. <laughs> and I will let you get all the way into melee with this priest and the triton and the champion. Yeah, that's And gonna get the cop's going to swing at you. Yeah. Mina has lost some of her hit points, so this is at advantage. Oh! It was sitting on 18. Just sitting there. Okay. And then it fell back to an 11. So that's a big old miss. Nailed it. All right. Fantastic. Yeah. Cool, 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 cool. That's where I want to be. All right. Um, Great. I would like to... Uh, shield bash this little priest who is doing the the blackness, please. Bring it on. Um, that was a 13, but I had Bardic saved. Add your bless first. Oh, true, true, true that. True that. Maybe we don't need it. Yeah, because you've got a D3 and a D4. Maybe we can add. Yeah, maybe. We... Yeah. That was a 1. <laughs> 14? Yeah. And the, that hits. Well, you also have a D3, but... I don't. Oh, no, that was Torkoal and Atreus. Got it. That was, yeah. Mm -hmm. 14's great. Love that. We're going to do that. I'm um, going to do some piercing damage. Ooh, uh, that's a 10. That's All right. nice. Um, as you uh, stab this thing and just kind of slice down it, um, it's blood's kind of disgusting coats you and um then it freezes gross and uh you take five points of cold damage worth it 
Lovely. Okay. Um. It's still up. Not it's still prone. up. Oh, oh. Yeah. Uh, I hit athletics it with my check. Yeah, I hit it with my shield. Yeah. yeah. I can't see that. Twenty. <laughs> Four. Okay, he sat. It falls down. Uh, let me make a concentration check on that. Sounds great. A spell I've got going over. Hydrate. Fail. Redeem hydrate. Fail. Everyone drink Fail. whatever the heck you I'm out of drink again. Oh, 19. Mm -hmm. What was that? I'm good. The spell's still up. Check. Damn it. Beach. Um, okay. Now it's time to stab him. Um, at advantage, because he is set. Uh-huh. Or. Yeah, that is. Yeah, it does. Um. Is the I don't think there's damage any way it can survive this? Flat, right? Or is it? Yeah. Okay. Ten. Wait. Okay, two. So yeah. Yeah. Four, four hit points left. Great. How, how do you want to end this guy? Um, I just, just straight, like, straight down. <laughs> and then and he turns into, up. like, a little, like, shrivelly thing. A little shriveled up puddle. Um, and the darkness vanishes. Much better. Nice. I always said that Mina was a light. <laughs> <laughs> Much improved feng shui here. Cool. Yep. Um, so I still have one more attack. Yes? Yes, and you do. There is a... You are right next to... The champion? The champion. Yep. I would like to stab him as well. You know. <laughs> He's... You want to stab him or shield bash him? Oh, that was a nat one anyway, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> okay. All right, never mind. Moving on. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> that's that's my turn. <laughs> All right. Um, the Triton slowly comes out of whatever um, strangulation hold the uh, priest had had on him, and uh, just kind of looks up at Mina and nods, like I'm okay. <laughs> Atreus, you're up. Okay, so Mina has. Gotten that dude. Mm -hmm. uh, You're currently soloing the general of the great. Army. Um, so get the fuck out of there. Let's... No, I stand my ground because I'm stupid. It's okay because he doesn't want to hit right you. Behind you, he's gonna come to your aid. It'll be fine. You are also stupid. Well, yes, but I'm gonna do so... more, more, more damage. <gasps> Wait, are you right? Are you the next? Like, no. I mean, Torkoal will... Oh, no, Kai still can go, too. Mm -hmm. It is not... Now everybody can see it the It is room. not the time for the cool... Are you sure? ...double religion moment. Is it? <laughs> I don't know. There's five minutes left, and we're calling the stream. So if you want to do it live, this is the time. Okay, okay, okay. okay well, but okay. Akira's so turn that... is not going to happen, so... That, yeah, Kira's turns are gonna happen. Damn it. Okay. We can make it happen. This... We, we can to. make it happen. Okay, let's make it happen. Okay. Go, go, go. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, but his um... armor class is really high. This is okay, gonna be would dicey. You fucking shut up. <laughs> Kill the war priest. <laughs> okay. Give me a sec. I'm trying to just look at it again. No, I'm not gonna do that today. Not today for it. But I am, so I'm going to let him get him again with the spiritual, I'm going to get this guy with spiritual weapon. Yep. Uh, dirty 20. Add your bless. Oh, yes. Uh, bless. Bless me, Father, for I have 22. Um, there you go. Great. That'll hit. And then I'm going to... Do the damage right there. It's 11 points of damage. 
can I toll the dead on this guy? Sure. Great. He's already he's he's already wounded. So he if he doesn't pass this, please don't pass this. Eleven. He does not pass my wisdom saving throw. So that's 2d12 because he's damaged. Mm-hmm. And I'm going to... Um, so that's 17 points of damage. And I remembered recently that I have... Uh, what is it called? Oh, Blessed Strikes. When I use a cantrip. Yep, yep. So that's uh, 1d8 of radiant damage to him as well. So somehow so you're seven. doing necrotic radiance. I'm doing necrotic radiance. And nicely done. Yeah. I don't always deal yeah, good damage, that makes your but when I do so much more powerful. Oh wow. it does. Oh, I'm yeah. so excited. I forgot about this. <laughs> you haven't had it for very long. I know, but I when I had it, I was like, oh that's fun. And then I haven't used it. All right, anything else for Matreus? Um, I think that was all of the things I can do. All right. Um, the warlock priest continues to shake and shiver with his little angry hand outstretched. <laughs> uh, the other one is dead. Very dead. So yeah, very dead. Dead, dead, dead. With Mina out of the way, our dear friend Makat is going to cycle around Atreus to put himself in melee with Torkoal and Akir. Um, so he is going to swing All right, let's first at Torkoal. So that's a wisdom saving throw. Okay. And if he fails, he has to pick someone else for this attack. Come on. That's a nat 20. He can attack. All right, fine. Yeah. But can he hit me? Uh, Torkoal, do you have all of your hit points? I do not. All right. So all four of these attacks are going to be at advantage. All four. Cool, 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 cool. 18. Total of 24 to hit. That will 24 match. To hit. Oh, oh, yeah, that'll, that'll, that'll make it, yeah. You take 16 points of damage. 16. Make me a that's concentration check. Not my favorite. Uh, constitution. That's going to be... Um, I'm going to crush an acorn. That's going to be a <laughs> 20. Because <laughs> <All right. laughs> that was a 4. That was a 4 plus 4 is 8, which is not what I want to see. But Are you, you blessed? Less- Hold on, you have D3. less and the D3. Oh. I, you automatically... Hold on. Those both will be ones. You're right. Hold on. Oh. Okay. Okay, so I so I make it. Okay, make so it. no acorn. Okay, I make it. Never mind. Acorn's still here. Phew. Yep, yep. Okay, forgot about that. Those of you who weren't here, uh, they all got a single acorn that they can use a reaction to crush, and it gives them a nat 20 on the roll. Uh, this was a 15 to hit, which I'm pretty sure misses you. That does miss. Swing again. There we go. I'm almost excited, because that's a nat 20 to but hit. But you can't you. crit him. Except that it doesn't crit. <laughs> because of my yeah. armor. My but adamantium a armor. Guaranteed adamantium. hit. Yeah, yeah. Fine. Take 12 points of damage and make another concentration check. And that brings me under half HP. That brings me down to 44. Um. All right. That constitution save is rolling very, very slowly. Oh, there we go. That's a uh, nine plus four yep, is fine. 13. Yep. Um, instead of clawing you, he's going to reach out and try and bite you. All right. Hmm. 21. 
Yeah, that'll do it. Make a constitution saving throw. 13 points of damage. That's a f 11 plus 4 is 15. Yep. How much damage hmm. was that? 13. Yeah, yeah, wow. He, he, he does. He hits hard. He yeah. hits hard. I, I am down to 31 <laughs> of 101. So I have taken 69 points of damage hey, oh. this right. encounter. I and I could. We're all being so I good, and you're the one who's going to do that? Nice. Come on. All right. Hey, I at least typed it in the it's private true, chat. It's true. I'm proud of you. Um, so he's going to just kind of tower over you and laugh and cackle at the just sheer amount of dwarf blood spilling out everywhere. Okay. Um, yeah. I'm, you know, Tor Torkel's not show showing any, any fear. He's definitely <laughs> worried, but he is not yeah, showing. he is the feared one at this point in time. Um, the divers are going to are going to swim away from Kai and into the fray because now they can see where they're going I was so afraid they were going to call for help <laughs> um, so Kai you may use your reaction to make an attack on one of them Ooh. Okay, let's do that. And if I do that, do I still get two attacks? No, this is just one attack, and it is not at advantage. Just one. Okay. <laughs> 18 will hit. 18? Yep. Eight points of magical nice. piercing. Um, both of them will swim up to stand side by side with their general and start unloading with their tridents on Akir, who has taken damage, so these are at advantage. Wow, that was awful. And eight is going to miss. Absolutely. I have rolled so many nat ones as the like offset. All right, twenty three to hit. I guess I already used my reaction, didn't I? Or I absorbed the acid damage. Okay. Oh yeah, it hits. Seventeen points of damage. Really? You're going to do me dirty? Nice. Another eight. Do him dirty again. With it. And the last swing with the trident. 20 to hit. 20 will miss because of Shield of Faith. Nicely done. Yeah. I was, I was ready. <laughs> yep. Uh, she's dead. The Locath is going to keep trying to things because why not Kai you are up all right so I'm going to yell to Thunin um get to the eel um cell so that's the first thing um and then how far am I from the fray uh, you are, if you want to get to one of the, the diver that swam away from you, be 5, 10, 15 feet, and 15 feet from Makat. Okay. I think... What I'm going to do... 
The chains that are holding up the low calf. Yep. Is it one chain? Um, it's attached around behind. So you'd have to kind of look it over if you wanted to see it, or you could just start breaking chains and hope it all falls off. Okay. So there's nothing like I couldn't I couldn't throw an axe at it to try and break it. Like there's oh, nothing. You absolutely can try. Yeah, there's chains. Okay. Yeah. All right. So we're gonna we're gonna move that direction. And we are going to situate ourselves so that we are 30 feet from Makat and um, 20 feet from the Locath. Is that feasible based on the map? So each square is 10 feet? So yeah, that should be feasible. So where would you like to be? Um... Hold on, let me let me drop you an updated map. Okay. Kai is here. <clears throat> Too many things on my screen to make this effective. Um, so I would like to, I have a swim speed of 40 as a Shahogan. So, um, if I get to, um. So you could get into melee with the low calf if you wanted to. I'm going to get into melee with. Um, yeah. Can I get up towards where Yasala is? Yeah, let's head that way. You could, if you want to dash, you could swim up and over everyone. No, let's not dash. Let's go towards where the low path is. Um, and then I'm going to use my two actions to try and break him free. All right. You have um, advantage on this check because you're raging. And I'm assuming it makes the most sense like in-game mechanics wise to try and do that like with my weapons or athletics like it's an athletics check whether you're at so you can either attack the chains or you can try and athletics it open. Got it. Let's attack them because that's more fun. All right, so then you're going to do that recklessly or just a flat? Um, I'm going to do it flat, I think. Okay. So that's a 20 on the first. Yep. Um, That'll hit the chain. That's a five points of damage. It does nothing to the chain. Okay. At all? At all. Okay, well, that's actually seven. It's still, yeah. Okay. Um, let's try that again, I guess. Um, Bless doesn't do anything for damage, right? Nope. Okay. That should have been at advantage. Does that matter? Do I have to reroll that? Uh, that's going to hit. Okay. And that is not going to do anything either. My nope. four points. Okay. Nope. You're just, uh, if you were not in water, you'd be making sparks against it. Okay. Um, I am going to use my um, bonus action to shoot a bolt of light at Makat. Nice. So that's a constitution saving throw for me? Yes, he needs to hit a 16. A 2 on the die. Really? Really? <laughs> so. 
Sorry. It's a seven overall, but... Okay, so he is going to take... Two points of radiant damage, and he is now blinded until the start of my next turn. Yeah, that's that's the kicker. That made it really... That, that's a nice spell. Really unhappy. Ah, it's not even a spell. It's just rage. Oh. Yeah. It's just rage. It this is This is the wild rage. magic rage. It's ridiculous. That <laughs> just means he can't do it consistently, unfortunately. Yeah. All right. Um, end of turn for Kai. Yep, end of turn. All right, uh, the Shahogan champion one, is just sitting one, in the corner, shaking. One quick retroactive thing: can I can I use my Sapphire Shield reaction on Makat and drop Sanctuary because I totally forgot I had that? Oh, um, sure. It's too late. Okay. He's he's got Let plenty. Go. Of, he would have stepped back up and kept swinging at you. Yeah. Oh, where's? Where is that damage? Hold on. 2d6 thunder damage. I'm just going to roll 2d6. Five. Nice. Okay, okay, good. Cool. Thank you. I know. There, we have so many things going on. So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I have a screaming baby that I'm going to go help my wife take care of. This baby's and not this. screaming. I haven't even looked at the video. Is the she baby's on? on the video. Right hey, the baby has that. joined us the and would like to do a can, Eliza can would like roll? to take a turn and swallow my cat. Yes. <laughs> um, she's doing great at that. Like you know? a damage, like, please. Is, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my cat can't see anything cute, and this or is terrifying. Charmed. Charmed. It's jammed. Mm, charmed. charmed. Oh, Damn. no one can resist stretching. her charm. Good, good job, Maddie. <laughs> It's true, she is very charming. Is that the end of our round? All that is right. the end of the round. So we All right. will finish this combat in the Discord. Find out how it goes. Come and watch. Um, one of the fun parts I love about Discord <clears throat> is when you get to see how they describe everything and the role play that my amazing players add into their um, commentary. So grab on that Ko-Fi. Coffee, little link down there, three bucks a month. Come join <laughs> us. Uh, help me decide more terrible things to do to them. And you will find out whether or not there will be a stream next week with how many of them Stop survive. It. Or Stop. if there's any new Stop players. It. No. We will no. Play. no. Anyway. They, there's, if, yeah. Is there if a better all, DM? If we all die, a lot we'll of fun. just stream without the DM <laughs> next week and pretend it never happened. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, yes. Hey, hey thanks for joining Do us, it. Ben. Join us in the Ko-Fi, and also in uh, the Discord. The Discord, thanks you'll be able to... to see recaps of the stream and what happens in the Discord if you aren't able to follow along. Yes. Whenever you want. <laughs> and we're pretty fun. And thank you so much for joining and watching, whether you're here in the Discord or not. We appreciate y'all yeah, being here. this is a great stream, everybody. Um, but we really appreciate all the interactions and that you guys... <laughs> with us to the people who are new here today that was really fun mm -hmm. hi yeah and eliza says here. hi and bye hi eliza oh. <laughs> can you see all right oh my god <laughs> she's just so cute <laughs> she's the cutest <laughs> the cutest little D, D player well we are going to roll out but um yeah, yeah. catch you next week oh. <laughs> bye Listen to these Bye. two. Bye. Have a great night.